you do it, man. It's, uh, it's Thank you. We are forever grateful you. <laughs> to you guys, all of you all. And it, this is something that we will continue to earn, not, not just be given, but, but continue to give back. Well, you know what? I guess there's just one thing left to say. Welcome home, Hughes family. Welcome home. Yeah! All right! Patrick? Yes? Why, don't you, why don't you take us out of here, man? Let's hear this. Old man really lived in that White House down the street where I grew up. Mama used to send me over with things. We struck a friendship up, spent a few long summers out on his old porch swing. We who have sight look upon Patrick Henry as a disabled person. We see a wheelchair, we see that he is blind, but he doesn't see that, nor does he feel that. And so to see this person go, uh-uh, I'm not disabled, I'm able. He is very able. I think Patrick Henry has touched many people's lives along the way for a long time. And we were honored just for a week to be in his presence. And bow my head. I'm finding more and more truth in the words written in red. Tell me that there's more to life than just what I can see. Oh, I believe. It makes me proud that I can say I was there. I was there the day Patrick Henry got his house, and, and uh, I was a small part of that with, with hundreds of other people who, who, uh, who made that happen, who came and, and really helped. And uh, that's when we get it right. That's when we know we have it right, when, when you can stand there and be proud that you were part of that moment. You know I'm more and more convinced the longer that I live. Yeah, this can't be. No, this can't be. No, this can't be all there is. Lord, I raise my hands. My main message, not to just people my age, but to everybody, is that it doesn't matter what kind of disabilities you might have or what kind of problems you might face on a day to on a day to day basis. If you set your mind to achieve a goal, then you can do it. I believe. I believe. Oh, I believe. I believe. Thank you.